It's October, which means it's Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And despite our yearly pink out awareness efforts, it's still one of the most prevalent cancers among women. In fact, one in eight women will be diagnosed in their lifetime, which means there's still plenty of work to be done. Today, we have Dr. Nicole Nelson, breast cancer expert and surgeon at MU Healthcare to tell us the latest information that we should know. Dr. Nelson, many of us associate breast cancer with a lump, and and that's the telltale sign, but that's not always the case, right? That is correct. So a lump is one of the easier signs to identify, especially if you're doing monthly self-exams. But there are a lot of other potential signs that women should be on the lookout for. Some of those include redness, dimpling of the skin, an orange peel look to the skin, nipple discharge, and pain. One important thing to note about pain is that it's actually far more likely to be caused by something other than breast cancer, but it's still important to take note of and get checked out if there's no explanation and it's not going away. So one of the the major focuses of breast cancer awareness is making sure that women know when to get screened. Why is that such a big deal? So regular annual screening mammograms for women starting at age 40 or earlier if there's a family history are the best way to find breast cancer early. Um, When we find breast cancer on a mammogram, on average, the size is about 1.1 centimeter, which is the size of a small blueberry. Uh, With our 3D mammograms, we're actually able to find things even earlier. The average size of a a lump that's found on self-exam is about 3.6 centimeters, which is the size of a strawberry. So that's a pretty big difference. Mm -hmm. And that growth from the size of a blueberry to the size of a strawberry is a lot of time for that tumor to grow and potentially spread. So if we can find these when they're smaller, it's going to be a lot easier to treat um, and a lot better potential outcomes. When it comes to detecting breast cancer, MU Healthcare offers quite a few options, right? Can you can you tell us about maybe some of those options? Yeah, so we offer the latest options for mammograms, including same-day conventional mammograms and 3D mammograms for dense breast tissue, as well as automated whole breast ultrasound and MRI. And our team can help patients understand their breast tissue and recommend which breast imaging options are best for them. Uh, we also have our new mobile mammography unit, which takes all of this really great technology on the road for patients who may have a harder time getting access to mammograms. That being said, breast self-awareness is important too. Getting familiar with your own breast tissue on a regular basis is the best way to notice when something is different. And as soon as you feel something that feels distinctly off, it's worth getting checked out. Now you are a, a specially trained breast cancer surgical oncologist. What does that mean exactly? So like many of the breast cancer experts on our team, it means I have quite a bit of training beyond my medical degree. I'm a fellowship trained breast surgical oncologist. So I have multiple years of training dedicated not only to surgery, but specifically to surgery related to breast cancer, such as tumor removal surgeries with lumpectomies or mastectomies, oncoplasty or improving the appearance of the breast after cancer surgery, lymph node removal, axillary reverse mapping to decrease the risk of lymphedema, really the whole gamut of breast cancer surgeries. One thing that I'm particularly proud of to offer in Mid-Missouri is oncoplastic breast surgery. This combines breast surgery with plastic surgery techniques to better preserve the natural look of the breast after things like a lumpectomy or another procedure that may otherwise create a cavity or a divot. And it's rewarding not only to be able to help patients with these life-saving procedures for their cancer, but also to be able to preserve a little bit of that post-procedural confidence as well. So at MU Healthcare, there's actually an entire team that is dedicated to breast cancer, right? That is correct. So our team includes not just our board-certified oncologists and surgeons, but really our entire team is specially trained in breast. That includes our nurses, our radiologists, our nurse navigators, really everyone on the care team has additional training in, in breast cancer. We've also got dedicated support staff like our dietitians and physical therapists who specialize in working with cancer patients. Not to mention, we've got some really great researchers that are helping to move cancer care forward at our Next Gen Precision Health Building and even in our hospital for our on-site clinical trials. Cancer is stressful enough. Our team really works together before, during, and after treatments to make transitions as seamless as possible, making sure that the patient and their family members are supported every step of the way. To learn more about MU Healthcare's breast cancer screening options and to schedule a same-day mammogram, visit muhealth.org slash same-day mammogram.